Hello everybody, welcome back to another Buildcraft episode of Season 3. This is Episode 9. What a wonderful day it is for me to bring another episode back to you guys. Today we're going to be touring a few different bases that we have never seen before on Buildcraft. It's going to be super fun. Um, we're going to start out with these two portals here. We've got a dirt one here and then a cobblestone one here. So we're going to go ahead and uh, pop right in uh, and see what is on the other side of this portal. I've taken a brief look, but I haven't really explored. So I'm really interested to see what this is for the first time with you guys. So as soon as you pop in, it looks like there's a few farms over here and looks like some buildings are uh, uh, being built uh, in the making. Um, and then it looks like they've got a little hut here. Let's see. Um, this is the mine, it looks like. Um, I guess that goes down to bedrock, and I'm sure it's just drip mines, probably. Probably nothing interesting down there. If there is, though, let me know. And there's phantoms, of course. Um, because what um, what kind of Minecraft day would it be without uh, lovely phantoms? So we're going to see if there is a bed here I can sleep in um, temporarily. Oh, ooh, this is really cool. I wonder what this is. Um, let's see if there's a bed in here. Um, looks like this is a nice little house. Um, it's just got the basics. Um, looks like it's got some barrels, a new chest, all the all the necessities, and it, uh, it even got a enchantment table. Really cool. Um, looks like they've got some good stuff, but the rarities are probably not stored here. Probably in the mines or something. Um, very very awesome. Let's see what this is. It looks like this is a automatic smelter. So yeah, it looks like they're making a ton of glass, um, and then all of this should be pushed over into this one chest, maybe right there. Yeah. Um, we've got some phantoms, oh my gosh. Um, looks like pretty much all it just gets funneled in here. I don't know what the, um, I don't know what the minecart is for. Does that put the coal in to the chest? I'm not really sure. Um, I guess we could check. What is in there? Is that a, uh, what is that, a hopper? Odd. Uh, I've never really seen this version of a... Uh, a, a smelting furnace before. Oh, you know what? Maybe it takes the stuff from in this, inside this chest and plops it into the, the furnaces. That's really cool. Um, it looks like nothing fancy over here. Just a wheat farm. You guys can see how bad I am at uh, fighting, <laughs> fighting phantoms. Oh, cool stuff here. Let's see. Does this lead anywhere? No. Um, I think that's where the other portal goes comes out, so we'll go check that out in a second. Um, but if we go in here, let's actually see what this is. Oh, wait a second. Oh, is this an automatic melon farm? That is, that is so cool. I don't, I can't tell if these are melons or pumpkins. I'm really bad. Okay, it looks like that one's a pumpkin. Maybe it's half and half, maybe. Um, that's really cool. I think these are detectors or something. I'm not really sure. But, uh, it looks like, uh, when they spawn in, it detects it. Or it detects that this is grown, and then it shoots down a piston to, to break the, uh, the melon or pumpkin. That's really cool. Um, and it looks like, I don't know what happened to these roofs. Maybe they were just never built or maybe something happened to them. Um, but either way, I hope they uh, get finished. It's going to be really cool when they, when they finally finish it, I think. Um, but let's go ahead through the portal. Um, we've got two more portals to go out through. Um, and then I think that's all I have for today. There's not been a ton of uh, production on the Buildcraft server um, lately. It's been really fun. Um, I played uh, a few days a week. Um, it, it's still fun for me, at least. I see uh, people on here from time to time. Um, but you can definitely tell it's slowing down quite a bit. But uh, nonetheless, I, I, I am going to try to do a, a few more things before the season ends. Um, I plan to end the season at the end of March. Um, so until then, we have, have the fun time to play on it. Um, let's see. This is a potato farm. I don't... I've seen many, many potato farms last week with JD's base we saw a carrot farm with the same sort of structure we had um we had some villagers near it and I'm not sure why the villagers are near it does it make it grow faster or do they just compost it do, what does the even what does the compost even do I don't know um looks like they had a water system doing something not really sure um but cool system nonetheless I, I don't know if it breeds villagers or what um but very cool that's really awesome um I don't know what it does but uh if you do let me know uh because i could probably use it somewhere in this world anyways um next base where are we going to it is over here okay this one i just took a brief look and it doesn't look like it's very furnished doesn't really look like there's anything there but it is kind of one of the coolest 
looking builds on Buildcraft, at least on the outside, um, I'll have to give you a full scope of it. It looks really cool. Um, so let's go ahead and head through here. Um, it's a nice blackstone base, uh, blackstone portal, really, really pretty. Um, head in here. We'll see what we find on the other side. Look at that. Okay. Look at this beauty. Okay. Look how tall um, this building is. If they put stuff in it, it would be amazing. Um, let's see what he's got over here. I haven't checked. A lot of prismarine crystals. Those are really cool. And of course, uh, blackstone for uh, the building, of course. And then uh, nothing in that chest. But let's go ahead, take a look see on the outside. Look at that pretty, beautiful view um, of the ocean as soon as you come out. But it is a double tall tower, um, two towers uh, at the top um, matching each other. Um, and then if we head around to the back, it's pretty much the same. There's nothing really built onto it, but it's really awesome um, what it is on the outside, which is really cool. Um, but look at that. That is really cool. Um, I really hope the owner does something uh, cool with this build because I would love to see this finished. Um, so if you're the owner, you know, finish it up. Let me know because uh, I would love to see what you have uh, in mind for it to be. Uh, but very cool. I love the lava idea. I think it's just one bucket on the top, like, just flowing down the whole thing, which is really cool. Um, but I've got one last thing to show you. Um, I think this is all I'm going to show for this episode. Um, but let's go ahead. I need my coordinates. We're going back to zero, zero, baby. Um, I believe it should be this way. Correct? Yep. Uh, yep. Um, and we're going to tour one more little miniature base. It's not like it's nothing crazy, but it is... Uh, it's kind of crazy, to be honest. <laughs> um, I also haven't checked those uh, portals. Uh, in a, like, I haven't checked those. And I probably should tour them in a second. But um, I'll do that. I'll save that for next episode if um, if I choose to do so or if I figure out it's something w that we haven't toured. Because I don't know what I've toured or, and what I haven't toured uh, these days. But um, here we're going into the villager house. This is one of the coolest stuff and one of the most useful things on the server. I cannot stress this enough. I've used this a thousand times and it didn't take me out the right portal the portals are sort of messed up these days um so i'm gonna see if i can just pillar my way up um because i have no clue where i even am um all the portals seem to have been destroyed uh from some some unknown reason um but don't even worry we're gonna make our what sell our ways up to the surface uh and see if we can tour a little bit of what the villager house looks like. It's really cool. Um, it's basically, I'll explain it while we're getting there. Um, it is a whole section of villagers, and they look amazing. Like, it, it's a whole breeding village, uh, an underground village for um, villagers. And you can pretty much get any enchantment you want from here, um, which is really awesome. Um, because I have, have, I've used that countless times for pickaxes, axes, um, shovels, swords, armor, everything. Everything in the game um, you can pretty much find here. So let's go ahead and f come in here. And there's some iron golems here defending as well. Um, it looks like a singular chest was blown up. But I'll pick up all this to make sure we don't lose anything. Here we go. Awesome. Perfect. Okay. So let's go ahead and tour this base. It's really cool. Um, as you can see, you breed the villagers over here. Um, if they have any good trades, they uh, drag them into these little pens where you can uh, trade with them. Look at all this. Wool. Um, more wool. Uh, swords. There's armor smiths. There's farmers. There's tons of cool guys. Um, and if you actually go down into the bottom, you can actually see the most valuable dudes, which I have utilized almost every day on the server, honestly. Um, they're the coolest stuff. Uh, right here, I'm breaking three. A uh, necessity for pretty much any armor piece or tool. Uh, mending, amazing. Um, let's see. Fortune 3, perfect if you are trying to uh, uh, make a good um, uh, pickaxe that, that can get you more ores, which is amazing. And there's Golden Knight. Look at that, Golden Knight, uh, 0114. He's been a, a huge player on the server lately. I know he's one of the, the final people who really are dedicated to the server, and I'm really proud of that because I love to see the enthusiasm um, carry out into the late uh, late weeks of the season because it is really cool um, when you have those dedicated players who just keep on going um, no matter what and make the server worthwhile. So thank you to all the people who, like him who have uh, continued to play um, and have not given up on the server because I know I haven't. I've played... I don't play probably as much as him, but I I play as much as I can. I, I play 
whenever I get the, the free time to, um, which isn't that much uh, lately, but um, it has been fun to, to, uh, to play nonetheless uh, for the time that I do get. But yeah, this is one of the coolest places on the server. Um, let me see if I can light the portal. It should just go back to the normal spot um, that it was. But yeah, um, a lot of cool stuff on the server lately. Um, a lot of this hasn't been made um, for a while, but definitely touring it um, in the later bit of the season is still really cool. So uh, thank you to all the builders who originally built this. And if you are still building, thank you to them as well. Um, but I think that's going to be it for today's world tour. So if you guys did enjoy, make sure to leave a comment. If you guys want to see anything before the next episode, the next episode should be the last episode of the season. So I'm really excited to bring that to you. I hope we can uh, finish out with a bang, which is really exciting. But until next episode, I'm Adam Webb, and I will see you all in the next one. Peace out, guys. I love you so much. Bye-bye.